I think I messed up. Join me as I try to avoid these five costly retirement mistakes that could seriously mess up my future. Planning for retirement is crucial, we all know it. But the reality is, many of us are making costly mistakes that can lead to financial struggles in our later years. We work hard, build our lives, but then we drop the ball on the one thing that's supposed to give us freedom and peace of mind later on. We're gonna dive deep into these mistakes and I'm talking real life examples, folks. We'll figure out how to avoid them together so you can retire with confidence. Let's get started. All right, folks, let's talk about mistake number one, not having a plan for retirement. This might seem obvious, but you'd be surprised how many people just wing it and hope for the best. That's like setting sail on the ocean without a map or compass. Not having a plan is a recipe for disaster. You need a solid plan, a roadmap to get you where you want to be. Do you want to travel the world, start a business, spend your days with grandkids? All great goals, but you need a plan to make them happen. So how do you create this retirement roadmap? First, figure out what you want your retirement to look like. What are your dreams? What makes you excited about this next chapter? Write those down. Next, crunch the numbers. How much money will you need to live comfortably? Factor in housing, healthcare, food, entertainment, the whole shebang. Once you know how much you need, figure out how you're going to get there. Are you saving enough? Investing wisely? Do you need to pick up a side hustle or find ways to cut back on expenses? This is where the rubber meets the road, folks. Remember, a goal without a plan is just a wish. Make a plan, stick to it, and retire like a rock star. Let's move on to mistake number two, not accounting for inflation. This one sneaks up on you like a thief in the night, silently eroding the value of your hard-earned savings. See, inflation is like a sneaky little tax that eats away at the purchasing power of your money over time. Think about it this way, remember when a gallon of gas cost a couple of bucks? Or when you could buy a candy bar for a nickel? Those days are long gone thanks to inflation. What you could buy for a dollar 20 years ago costs significantly more today. Now imagine that happening to your retirement savings. You think you've saved enough, but inflation comes along and slowly chips away at the value of your nest egg. So how do you fight back against this silent thief? First, you gotta acknowledge it's there. Don't bury your head in the sand and pretend inflation doesn't exist. It does, and it's coming for your money. Second, factor inflation into your retirement planning. Most financial experts recommend assuming an average inflation rate of 3% per year. Plan for it, invest wisely, and keep your buying power strong. Chapter three, don't leave money on the table. Maximize tax advantaged accounts. Let's talk about mistake number three, folks, not maximizing tax advantaged accounts. This one's a real head scratcher because it's like leaving free money on the table. Why work hard for your money only to give a big chunk of it back to the government in taxes when you can avoid it? We're talking about accounts like 401, Ks and IRAs, powerful tools that can help you build a comfortable retirement while keeping more of your hard earned money in your pocket. Let's start with 401 Ks. These are employer-sponsored retirement plans that offer some fantastic tax advantages. With a traditional 401 K, the money you contribute comes out of your paycheck before taxes are taken out. This means you're reducing your taxable income right off the bat, putting more money back in your pocket today. And the best part, the money you contribute grows tax-deferred, meaning you don't pay taxes on it until you withdraw it in retirement. Many employers offer something called a 401 K match, where they contribute a certain percentage of your salary to your 401 K as long as you contribute too. It's free money, folks, and you'd be crazy not to take advantage of it. Now, let's talk about IRAs or individual retirement accounts. These are perfect for folks who don't have access to a 401 K or want to save even more for retirement. Just like 401 Ks, IRAs come in two main flavors traditional and Roth. Maximize your tax advantaged accounts today. Chapter 4. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. The power of diversification. Let's talk about mistake number 4, not diversifying your investments. This one's a classic, folks. You know the saying, don't put all your eggs in one basket? Well, the same goes for your retirement savings. Imagine this. You put all your money into one stock because you think it's a sure thing. But then, the unexpected happens. The market takes a downturn, the company faces unforeseen challenges, or maybe the CEO runs off with all the money. Whatever the reason, your investment tanks, and you're left holding the bag. That's why diversification is so important. 
it's all about spreading your risk across different asset classes so that if one investment takes a hit, the others can cushion the blow and keep your portfolio afloat. Think of it like building a sturdy house. You wouldn't build a house with just one material, would you? No. You'd use a combination of wood, concrete, steel, and other materials to create a structure that's strong, durable, and can withstand the test of time. Diversifying your investments is the same concept. You want to build a portfolio that's diversified across different asset classes, such as stocks, bonds, real estate, and commodities. This way, you're not overly exposed to any one particular asset class or sector, and your portfolio is better equipped to weather market storms. Remember, diversification is not about avoiding risk altogether, it's about managing risk effectively so you can achieve your long-term financial goals. So, spread those investments around, build yourself a sturdy portfolio, and ride out those market fluctuations like a pro. Chapter 5. The Healthcare Hurricane Don't let medical expenses derail your retirement. We've arrived at the fifth costly retirement mistake, not considering healthcare costs. This can really throw a wrench in your retirement plans. As we get older, healthcare needs increase and costs can add up quickly. Doctor's visits, prescription drugs, hospital stays, long-term care, these expenses can eat away at your nest egg. How do you protect your retirement savings? Start by acknowledging potential costs and planning accordingly. Don't bury your head in the sand. Be proactive and take steps to mitigate healthcare costs. Understand your Medicare coverage. Medicare is for people age 65 and older, but it doesn't cover everything. There are gaps in coverage, deductibles, and co-payments. Consider supplemental insurance options to fill in those gaps. Explore long-term care insurance. It can help cover costs and protect your assets. Prioritize your health. Eat a healthy diet, exercise, get enough sleep, and have regular checkups. Staying healthy reduces your risk of costly medical bills. Build a healthcare fund for expenses. Secure your future. Avoid these mistakes and retire with confidence. Did you know that 70% of retirees will require long-term care at some point in their lives? The cost of this care can be staggering, with prices ranging from $40,000 to over $100,000 per year. This shocking statistic highlights the importance of addressing these retirement mistakes sooner rather than later. You don't want to be stuck with insufficient funds when you need them most. In summary, avoiding these five costly retirement mistakes is crucial for a secure and fulfilling retirement. Remember, it's not just about saving money, it's about having a clear plan, accounting for inflation, maximizing tax advantaged accounts, diversifying investments, and considering healthcare costs. Take the time to review your retirement plan and make the necessary adjustments to ensure a brighter financial future. Thanks for watching, and I'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Have you made any of these mistakes? Or do you have questions about retirement planning? Share your experiences and ask your questions. And don't forget to check out my other videos on retirement planning for more insights.